early start of the day. Time to go chat up an orc. Not, not in that way, really. Um, I've never really, uh, I've never really found orcs all that attractive, frankly. All right. I keep sprinting and forgetting that um, yeah, my legs aren't what they used to be. Well, except for that, I can still land on my feet. Hello, Fox. How are you? What did I just hear? Was that just a fox? I'm sure that was just a fox. Right. If I see another werewolf on this road, I'm going to have a cow. Excuse me, rabbit. Careful, there's a fox down there. Circle of life and all that. Oh, long climb up. Long climb up to Bruma. I remember walking along the roads, and I'd be there w with a colleague of mine. I'd be there talking to myself constantly, and then when I shut up, stopped talking to myself, he would start humming or, or singing, and he had the most beautiful voice. And I quite miss it, frankly. And thus I am left talking to myself constantly again, just to fill space. He always made fun of me for it too. Well, sort of. Okay. Almost there. Come on, little father. Come on, legs. <sighs> okay. Good enough. I don't really want to alert everybody here that I'm not exactly up to no good, but uh, given Simmons' position within the court, I'd uh, rather not ar arouse too much suspicion. Let's see if he's even awake. I'm sure he should be. Let's see. There he is. Hello. Can I help you? I found a letter at Simmons' house. Let me see that. This... That... That bastard. Yes. He did it. I can tell. Plain as day. <sighs> Tries to speak in riddles, but it seems he's not all that good at subtlety. We found the bastard. And it seems... It implies he got her alive. Perhaps she's still alive. Come, my friend. It's time we got to the bottom of this. Once and for all. Ugh. We're going to Gautier's house. Now. I'll follow your lead. It's time for retribution. Why? Wait, why are we going there? He wasn't there when I went. And I was there last night. Are we really going to run all the way out back there? Well, he wasn't at the castle when I went to do a little investigation while you were away. So he must be somewhere. I bet he's at the house. Just probably not in plain sight. Slimy Breton bastard. All right, let's do this. Time to get payback. <laughs> what was it that you were fond of saying? The, uh... What was it, magic practicing ponces? <laughs> Away with words. They call me Gort. Oh, good for you. All right, let's do this. Oh, we've got, got to run all the way back out there. We have to run all the way back out to the manor. Why didn't he just come with me to begin with? Although I am rather glad we didn't waste his time. Just mine. Be careful if you head into the northern part of the county. Let me guess. Avalanches. avalanches. Yep. 
Right, um... Down this way, yes? Try not to take any unnecessary wrong turns. I want to get this done as quickly as possible, and I'm sure he does too. Um... Right. Keep it up, Doomrag! Do Doomrag, is that how you pronounce your name? Pardon my, uh... First of all, pardon my lungs. Second of all, pardon my, uh, Colovian accent. It's a bit, um... Oh. Now I can go talking to myself again. Ah, oh, there he is. Dear Mara, that orc has some legs. <laughs> we can keep sprinting for that long. Right. That. Okay. That one. That one hurt a little bit. Uh. Which way was it? It was this way. Yes. Well, this was the last thing I expected to be doing first thing in the morning. I'm not sure what else I expected. Certainly wasn't this. Hello, Fox. Keeping up, Doomrag. Rag, rag, rag. Orcish names. I'm sure it's rag or rog. I would rather not call him dumb rag. That just sounds weird. Doom rog is more um threatening. And orcish. And uh, he is rather threatening and orcish. You're right back there. Yeah, he's fine. Um, pardon me while I get us lost. I can't remember where the turn was. It was up here somewhere. I keep losing track of the place. Ah, dead bandits. Don't mind them. Needless to say, I'm uh I'm alright with my spells. Not exactly a magic practicing pawns of a Breton, but uh <laughs> magic practicing ponces. I'm still laughing. Yeah, right, it was through here. Oh, hello, dear. Excuse me. Mara, there are some days I wish I could run like that. That reindeer caribou thing. Deer. Elk, whatever they're called. I what people in Skyrim call them. again. And he has a friend. Or she. Actually, I, I don't know. Do female reindeer grow antlers? I'm sure they do. I've read- I, I think I remember reading something about that somewhere. Oh my. Looks like we've got company. You really shouldn't. Greetings, friend. I'm not sure if you're aware, but this is a royalty-only byway. And since you don't look like royalty, you have to pay the toll. You, um... Uh, you really want to say that with my orc friend right here? We'll see if you put up this much of a fight when you're lying dead on the ground, eh? Big right. <laughs> you're supposed to hit enemies, not... Sorry! Ah. You're kind of a large target. Well... Yeah, I'll let you handle the heavy hitting from now on. How about that? I'll try not to, uh... hit you again. I'd rather not invoke your ire. But he seems like he hits like a troll, frankly. And I mean that in the best way so possible. this is it, huh? Yep. 
damned Breton and his creature comforts. Let's <laughs> All right, well, this is the place. Did you look at this? Silverware. Materialistic Breton bastard. Doesn't surprise me. Well. Yeah, I found the, um... I found the letter upstairs, if you were wondering. I also uh, had to uh, dispose of a few people. That's what he thinks of her? Of course it is. Just another one of his possessions. Another trophy in his cabinet. That slimy... <laughs> I mean, if she's still alive, I'm sure. Wait. Would you look at this? What? There's a trap oh. door under here. Looks like these barrels got pushed over it. <laughs> well? That little eel tried to hide himself by hiding the way in, eh? Huh. Well, I didn't see this when I was uh, first poking around in here. Let's see. Well, there we go. That's that. Now let's march down here and find my wife. Absolutely. Say what you will about this old paddle of a sword, but it really does do the trick when it comes to busting open barrels. Whew. Today went better than expected, I suppose. But some nosy type came asking around. About mercenaries and bandits and payments. Oh dear. I told you the brute was back in town. And now it seems he's got a lackey who's on our scent. I even felt the need to barricade us in here for protection. This Constant running and hiding is... I know. This is... I don't know. This is still so strange. They're observant, aren't it's they? It's hard wrapping my head around it sometimes. Yes, I... I know what you mean, dear. But sometimes things just... <laughs> happen. And you're foolish to fight back. It's unfortunate that we have to keep our relationship as secret as we do, but what choice do we have? Quiet now, Simond. Just relax. You sneaky, slimy, slithering bastard! Here with my wife! My... wife! You deviant, backstabbing... She's mine, dumbrag! She loves me! Your lies can't save you it's now, true. you ignorant son of a... I... love him. A tool, you... Faithless wretch! How dare you! How dare you forsake me so brazenly for this corrupt, spineless... Breton? Doomrock, I... Enough of this! Atul loves me! She no longer loves you! You must come to terms with that orc! Now, leave our home and never bother me or her ever again! This... comes as a shock. What, what do I do? What, what... What do I do? Leave him be. Try to forget they ever existed and rebuild your life as best you can. Trust me, I know how this goes. I'd rather not talk about it if it's all the same to you. I... You're right. This was bad business all around. No good can come from stooping to this level anymore. I know coincidences, and this certainly wasn't one. Too meticulous, too perfect, too pre-planned. <laughs> right, well... Good luck. Poor guy. And you? Do you need something? No. You're just a rotten piece of work, really. Making off with someone's wife, really? Ah, <sighs> well. Where's the door? Get myself turned around in this place. Well done. 
Okay. What do you need? I need some air, thank frankly. Ugh. Well, that was ugly all around. You know, I really do wonder if I can get into that spire. There has to be a path around here somewhere, surely. Ah, I wonder if that's it. I wonder if that's it and I just missed it the first time I came past here. That would not surprise me in the slightest. Okay, let's see. Well, that didn't really lead anywhere useful. Ah, here we go. Is that a dog? Hello. What are you doing here? Huh. Who are you? You're a cute one. You, let's see if you have any... Uh... I need to look at you closer, I think. Obviously, you belong to somebody. You're not feral. I don't think. You're right out here. Oh, he's all bruised up and scratched his fur off. No, no, he didn't scratch it off. It looks like somebody. His collar reads Scruffy, owned by Bacchus Jucani of Bruma. Well, Bacchus Jucani, you are rather a scoundrel. All right, Scruffy. Do you want to come with me, boy? <laughs> I can promise I'll treat you better than um, than what was his name, Bacchus Jucani. Obviously, his last name was Jukani. I remember that. I do believe this is the path up to the spire, and I do believe I missed it the last time. Oh, Scruffy, you don't really, um... You don't really mind trekking up here with me, do you? Probably not. Oh, there's a rabbit. I don't really have much food in my pack, but... If, uh, if this dog has managed to make his way all the way out here... You must be something of a hunter. You are, aren't you? You're right there. Everything alright? Alright, yep, he's still, he's still coming with me. I'll find him a better, um, better owner as soon as I get back to Bruma, but, um... While I'm here, I might as well... Check this place out. If I can get up there in a timely manner, of course, I... I think I will be... Scruffy? Ah, there you are. <laughs> you alright there, boy? No, this is the path that I took the last time because I remember that view. Well, more or less. I think the north, uh, the more north you get into the Gerals, they just all start looking the same. Until you come up, until you come out the other side, of course. All right. Oh, it's windy up here. It's windy and it's cold. And there's wolves. Doesn't that just figure? All right. Yep. Well, he got one good nip in on me, but, um... Oh, look, there's a rabbit. Ah, yes. I got completely turned around last time. Why doesn't that surprise me? Oh, damn this wind, though. 
this is uh, not pleasant. As soon as we get around the side of the mountain though, it should ease up a little. You all right there, Scruffy? Yeah, he's fine. Yeah, fine. He's got a big thick coat of fur, even though some of it's missing. <laughs> oh boy. Well, he can rest in there for a while, I suppose. Perhaps. Depending. Ah! All right, here we are. Looks like there's mages here. I wonder if they're Synod or College. Or Synod or Whispers. I don't know, how would you, uh... Well, it's rather windy out here. And cold as, um... Cold as. It, um, well, that's the mage, the mage's guild symbol, which means it's rather old. And how does this door open exactly? Oh boy. I wonder who built this? 